Wait a minute, you're not Charles Darwin. Oh shit. He's in trouble. The unspeakable has happened. A policeman arrested Mr. Darwin and carried him away as if he were nothing but a common criminal. That policeman. He is corrupt to the bones, I'm sure of it. Oh, I do so fear for Mr. Darwin's safety. Miss Nightingale, do you know where they might have gone? The policeman. He did mention a funeral. I believe I know where it is. Follow me. Poor Mr. Darwin has been through so much recently. Those people are trying to discredit a lifetime of work. It's disgraceful. And I fear Mr. Darwin is no longer the fit young man who once traveled the world. Here we are. The obsequies are taking place here. Are they trying to bury him alive? Better hurry now. You can find me here afterwards. Getting out the policeman without being detected. There he is. Target located. Now what the hell is going on here? Is it like a party for coppers? Find some secluded spot to hijack him. I'm not letting him out the side. Well, kidnap him. What do you want from me? Where's Just need you to answer some questions. Where's the nearest exit? Oh, you're a brash one, aren't you? It's been said. <clears throat> if I just knew where to get this guy without without being noticed. Surrounded by fences and cops. There seems to be no clear path. Maybe through here. Just stay still. I know that my Redeemer liveth, and that he shall stand at the latter day upon the earth. And though after my skin worms destroy this body, yet in my flesh shall I see God, whom I shall see for myself, and mine eye shall behold, and not another, though my reins be consumed within me. Come on, goddamn move. For none of us liveth Fucking shit. Gotta no avoid these guys. And that preacher's just repeating the same line all over again.
Finally. I was just carrying out my orders. Go for the love of God. Arresting an old man and dragging him off to Lord knows where is fine work indeed for a policeman. Now, sir, tell us where you have taken Mr. Darwin. A man paid me to bring him to his secret base. How terrible. We will need transportation. Well, there's our transportation, right where we need. Not this one. Oh well. Let's go. That's a girl. Get the hell out of the way. Two guys upstairs. Hello, Charles. Very weak. We shouldn't move Mr. Darwin until I've seen to his wounds. They're here! Attack! Uh oh. Who else wants some? Just a moment, and take these guys' stuff. Might need it. Just a moment. Hang in there, Charles. We'll get you out of this yet. ever. Yeah. 
Alright, get in, get in, get in. <clears throat> Rest up, Mr. Darwin. My sister and I will be along shortly. screen. Come on. Well, look who's here. We were very worried about you, sir. We're looking spry for a fossil, sir. A man's friends are the best measure of his worth. I'm proud to count you among mine. The dangers pass us. No need to leave, sir. What Mr. Darwin needs now is rest. To that end, he's joining his family on the Isle of Wight. Rest, indeed. I shall start work on my next book. I must insist that you recuperate quietly, sir. The acquisition of knowledge is in itself sufficiently recuperative. Go, tell her. This is one fight I aim to avoid, sir. Thank you for everything, Still my friends. Still determined. Ideas, like people, can only thrive when they are free. You take care of Charles. Quite the chap, gotta say. Dinosaur Talon. Unique materials. But for what? Hey! Idiot. <clears throat> now where to next? Rouge's Vault. Haven't checked that one out yet. But I might. <laughs>